Hey guys, so long time no see. I just moved into my new apartment in Los Angeles like five days ago, so it's been a hectic, crazy past five days. It's just been crazy. I just, I go to the store and then I come home and I'm like, fuck, I forgot something. So I, I've literally been to Target like five times in the past two days. It's been really crazy, but finally I have most of my things in place. And I know a lot of you have been asking for an apartment tour. So that is what I'm going to be showing you guys today. Unfortunately, like, not everything is the way that I want it to be right now. I think for somebody who's only lived here for five days, I've done a pretty good job at, like, organizing and decorating everything. So, yeah, I hope you guys like my apartment, and I'll see you in just a second. Okay, so I'm at the front entrance of my apartment, and as you can see, I have my living room right here. And if you look straight ahead, there is my kitchen and my dining room. Let's just walk over here. This table I got at Home Goods. It was like $99. And I just decided it'd be a good little entrance way type table. And here we have a picture of my boyfriend and his dad. There is a picture of, I don't, let me focus on that. That's a picture of Montreal that I decided to frame. And here we just have a random jar. I think we'll just, we're just gonna use it for change. And then these are some post cards from Utah that I plan on sending to family. Here's a head of Caesar because why the hell not? Some random candle, some notebooks and pencils. And then this I got in Target. It was all on clearance. I think the vase was like 20 bucks and these were like, I think, free. And here we have the kitchen. Woo woo! All right guys, you will never believe how much this entire dining set was. The table and the four chairs were $195. Can you freaking believe it? So cheap. Um, these are some placemats. I think my mom got these for me at Home Goods. And then yesterday I went to the hardware store and I found this little cute bamboo plant. So I decided to get that too because it doesn't need any sunlight. So it's really perfect if you want to plant but don't have any sunlight, which we do, but whatever. Um, this is the most expensive trash can I've ever bought in my life. It was $50 at Home Goods, but I really like the color. And I think it's good to invest in a good trash can because if you get a crappy one, it's going to smell up your apartment. And we have a really small apartment, so we didn't want to, you know, have it smelling like garbage. Here is our kitchen, and it's really nothing special, but it's definitely good for two people. And I don't cook a lot, but, like, I am able to cook like I can I can make mac and cheese and chicken parm and all those basics so the kitchen's good enough for like cooking in it a couple times a week other days we're probably just gonna do takeout or go out to dinner um here is my coffee maker I think this was like 30 bucks at Target this is a Buddha board which um I guess my boyfriend bought or whatever and yeah you draw with water and it disappears after a while after it dries up. So basically it's completely pointless. Um, here's our stove with some pots and pans, our little refrigerator. Here we have a toaster, sink. I mean, this is all really self-explanatory. We have uh, plates, bowls, cups, glasses, everything in there. And then we have our food in this cupboard. If you see any junk food, odds are it's my boyfriend's because he eats like that 12 year old. And this is my refrigerator. Very bare at the moment. Not much happening in here. We have some beer, some wine, judge us. All right, so we're leaving the kitchen and now onto the living room. Oh, and here is a mirror. This mirror was like, think like $50 at Home Goods. I just loved it. And my friend Lewis, who lives here in Los Angeles, who's basically like my only friend here, um, suggested that I get a large mirror for my living room because mirrors make things look bigger. And I got it based on his recommendation and I love it. All right, so here is the living room. We just got Wi-Fi and today and I'm so freaking happy oh and this table was like $50 at home goods steal and here is this lamp from Target that was like really expensive for no reason at all it's literally made out of paper um, then I got this ottoman for I think was like $40 at home goods as you can see I got a lot of things from home goods the most expensive thing that we got was this couch which is like absolutely amazing I don't know if you see how gigantic this couch is but it is seriously 
enormous and look at the fabric it's like a teddy bear fabric and it is so comfortable and so squishy and just amazing I literally sat on this couch and was like yep we're buying it um I think it was like around eight hundred dollars for just this one couch but it was so worth it and we just absolutely love it and yeah and I got these cute decorative pillows at home goods just to like as an accent pillow because we didn't want to be boring and have everything be just one color here we have a little room fan that rotates it's really convenient because it's hot as fucking balls here um and here we have our little entertainment center um I just have my ps3 there and the cable box and our wi-fi is hooked up there so yeah, that's pretty much our living room right now. We're wondering if we should get a coffee table and eventually in the future we are going to get like a chair to put here and then this ottoman will just slide over here and use it as like a footrest. So yeah. Oh, and I got this candle yesterday. It's I think Yankee Candle. Pina Colada, oh, it smells so good. Here is the little hallway area that also doubles as my vanity. Um, these closets right here I am using for um, some of my clothes, my purses and things like that. But here I got this little ottoman from Target and here I have my mirror, my makeup. Um, there's these drawers that I basically keep all of my makeup in. Here I have all of my eyeshadow palettes. And inside of the ottoman I have all of my heat styling tools like my curling iron, my straightening iron, etc. Um, this is my boyfriend's closet and I'm not going to open it because I just know it's a mess. That's our dirty stuff and this is our bathroom. So I decided to go with like a blue beachy theme for the bathroom and pretty much everything I got at Home Goods. Um, I got these at Home Goods. These are adorable and they all match. What a cute little soap dispenser. Here we have our medicine cabinet. Um, our sink, the toilet, um, just a cute little blue candle, window, a little bit of artwork, some matching towels, and here is our shower, boop, and here is my stuff. Not the biggest bathroom, but it's cute. It gets the job done. And then walking out of our bathroom into our bedroom, which is extremely bare at the moment. Like we have nothing in here. All we have is a bed and some end tables with matching lamps. And I do plan on doing much more with this bedroom, but for now we're just gonna keep it simple. I do plan on getting like a leather or a white leather headboard for the bed. And of course, I'm planning on putting some curtains on the window, maybe a cute little rug, and then over here in this space, I was thinking maybe a small desk with a chair. But yeah, and this is our closet. I use this closet for the majority of my clothes. It is gigantic. Seriously, look at this closet. I keep all of my shoes in there and my bags. And yeah, like I absolutely love it. And this closet is so big that I haven't even used all of it. Look at all this space that I have. We're pretty much using the other half of the closet for my boyfriend's stuff. There we have our sleeping bag. I don't know why on um, our suitcase from the ride over here. And yeah, that's pretty much our bedroom. I think it's cute. So yeah. That is our apartment. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, this is our first apartment that we have ever moved into. And I think for somebody's first apartment, it's definitely, you know, nice. It's nothing fancy, nothing crazy, but it's definitely homey. And I feel like we're gradually making it our own. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this apartment tour and I'll see you in my next video. Love you, bye.